And listen to this, several canines died from heat distress while being transported from O'Hare to a training facility in Michigan City. WGN's Andrea Medina reports from Northwest Indiana. I saw kennels lined up behind this white box truck. Um, and I, and I, already, I instantly knew that it was something to do with dogs in the back and not well. The combination of dangerously hot temperatures and a malfunctioning air conditioning in a box truck on Thursday night led to the deaths of some police canines in Lake Station, Indiana. Police say the driver stopped at the Road Ranger gas station on Ripley Street to get the dogs out of their crates after hearing them bark. It was very chaotic. There was a bunch of people, you know, um, bystanders trying to help these dogs. There's so many people inside the gas station where the dogs were cooling off at. A bunch of them had IVs. Nicole Lubarski witnessed the canines in distress. As a dog mom of two, it broke her heart. Oh, yeah, it dropped immediately because you have to think about how how intense that heat must have been. The majority of them all had heat stroke. Jennifer Weber of the Humane Society of Hobart responded to the scene and says 18 German Shepherds came from Europe. We know that five right now are still hospitalized. Four were allowed to leave um, with uh, the owner last night. And one he sold right on site for $7,500, who is still currently hospitalized. So we believe that we have um, lost a total of seven so far, maybe eight. Lake County police say the canines were being transported from O'Hare to a training facility in Michigan City. Police go on to say the driver was stuck in traffic for two hours and wasn't aware the AC wasn't working in the separated cargo area where the dogs were. In all honesty, um, we did not feel as the Humane Society that their housing was standard. Uh, their, their water bowls were the size that you give a parrot or a bird, and they were all dry along with, um, you know, severe chew marks and um, tearing up of the inside of the kennels. Police call this incident a freak event and don't believe there was an act of animal cruelty or neglect, but a mechanical failure of the AC unit. But Weber says there were still several violations of Lake Station municipal codes. It's unfortunate that Lake Station let him leave uh, in a box truck with the doors off, the animals were not secured in the vehicle. Both Weber and Lubarski feel the dogs went through needless suffering and hope justice can be given to them. I just want answers on who are these people, what do they do this, how, how are they going to prevent this in the future. And that was Andrea Medina reporting. The driver is not facing any charges.